Chrissy says, I have a question unrelated to the topic. My boyfriend has always been pretty nice, but lately has been overly nice. Am I wrong to suspect him of cheating if he's never acted like this before? Well, my question, Chrissy, to you is why would you immediately go to cheating? <laughs> right? So he's been really nice. He must be cheating, right? There's a lot of, and, and, and so the question might be for you first is, I, I don't know right? Do you have a pattern of dating men who cheat on you, right? Uh, is there reasons why you might suspect a guy? So if you have a pattern of dating men who have cheated on you and you've been with guys who cheat on you a lot, then one of the first things that you need to do is take some space for yourself and change the way that you think about yourself. Because usually most people live in patterns, right? We all live in patterns. Everything's a pattern, right? We, we do the same things every day. We get into the same types of relationships unless we make significant changes within ourselves, right? And so uh, a lot of what we do is based on past things that we've done before in our life. It doesn't have to be that way, but for most people it is. And so if you have been dating men, who cheat on you often, or maybe you've dated a guy who's cheated on you in the past, what you need to do is some healing work, right? Because what ended up happening probably is that a guy cheated on you and then you made it mean some certain things about yourself, about life, about the world, about men. And so what you need to do is figure out um, you know, what those things are, bring those things to the surface and then start questioning whether those things are actually true or not. That way you don't end up continuing the pattern of getting into situations where you're hurt, abused, cheated on, or whatever kind of situations you're in, right? That's the way to break that pattern. You have to believe that you're deserving of something more, of something greater. Otherwise, what you'll see is that pattern happen in other guys, and then you'll feel comfortable around that pattern, and you'll feel attracted to it. And so you need to break the pattern. And so that's that's if it's going on with you. Uh, you haven't told me anything. I mean, being overly nice, it could mean he's high, right? <laughs> like there's, there's a lot of reasons people could be overly nice. And so... Uh, I mean, the idea of him cheating on you, I mean, you know, unless you have some kind of evidence from the past or, you know, you have a pattern of doing this. And so you keep on ending up with guys who are cheaters. And so that's your pattern. Unless you have something like that going on, there's, there's no reason that I would feel like, you, you know, it would give me any cause to believe that he was cheating on you. 